have no idea what caused it, but this is McFucked. Like, it just completely crapped itself. Snap camera's not working, my capture card's not working, computer's completely, completely died. Back, face, island. Cool, we got our face back. That's one part. Let's go get our PS5 back. Oh, come on, work with me today, buddy. Complete blue screen, out of nowhere. No idea what happened, I'm so sorry. Must have thought the character was that hot that it died on us. Come on. Delete video capture device. New video capture device. PS5. Alright, we're back. We are back. So you and you go down here. Alright, so where we left off, we we're going for the ugly stepsister from Shrek. So the ugly stepsister from Shrek. We've got red lips. I'll give you a normal mouth. Who's the guy? Yes. Nose. Already giving you a fat nose, so you're good. Lipstick, I can't change the color of your lipstick. Maybe I can. Let's go with that. Back, back. Alright. So, this is twitch.tv slash John O. We have this character here, which we're going to call the Ugly Stepsister from Shrek. We love it. Um, you know what? Do we want boobs? Nah, I need it to look butch. Yep. That's what we're going with. We're happy with that, people. We're jumping in. Hope there's no more blue screens and check me dashboard. Dashboard is fine. Let's get right to it. King Alant the Twelfth, by channeling the power of souls, brought unprecedented prosperity to his northern kingdom of Boletaria. That is, until the colorless deep fog swept across the land. Boletaria was cut off from the outside world, and those who dared penetrate the deep fog never returned. But Val from the fog and told the world of Bo that the old King Alant had roused the Old One, the great beast below the Nexus, from its eternal slumber. And that a colorless fog had swept in, unleashing terrible demons. The demons hunt down men and claim their souls. Those who lose their souls lose also their minds. The mad attack the sane and chaos reigns. Valifax also spoke of the enticing power of the demon souls. Each time a demon claims a human soul, the demon's own soul is invigorated by the life force, and the power of a mature demon soul is beyond human imagination. The legend spread quickly, 
Mighty warriors lured by the possibilities braved the fisher to breach the accursed land. But none have returned. Bior of the Twin Fangs. Yet the silent chief. Fuck you. Yeah. Saint Urbain. Skurva the Wanderer. The sixth Saint Astria with her knight Gahl Vinland. And Sage Freak the Visionary. The colorless deep fog slowly creeps beyond Boletaria's borders. Humankind faces a slow and steady extinction. The deep fog will eventually swallow all lands near and far. But Boletaria has one final hope. A lone warrior who has braved the baneful fog. Oh, has the land found its savior? Or have the demons found a new slave? Brave soul who fears not death. I shall guide you to the fissure. So that you may lull the old one back to slumber. Whoa. So we're here. So I need to get used to this, so this game has got omnidirectional rolling, so before you could only roll forward, back left, right, but now it's implemented Omni, so you can go diagonal as well. So, I need to move my face and everything, because it's a bit bad down there. No, we want you, and we want you. You are going to go over here. Marvellous. So, our soul counter is up in the top right, our health is in the top left, our equipment and everything is in the bottom. I'm not used to this hub. Rings. Fragrant ring, providential ring. Restores MP over time. Raises item discovery. We have half moon grass, con counteracts poison. Okay, wall tendency, character tendency, so they show us both. Okay. Settings. So, what have I got in my right hand? I've got a rapier and a silver... I've got a silver catalyst, okay. Do I have any spells attuned to my character? Because I'm meant to have a spell. I do? There we go. used to this. Standard attack. Does our magic... Okay, click, click. Our magic should recover as we play. Oh! Spell animations are slower. Now, is my MP increasing? Yes it is, but ever so slightly. My best off with a rapier. bad boys. Uh, 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 
magic is OP in this game. Or it used to be. I don't know anymore now. Just make sure there's no one behind me. I have beef with the display and the camera. Wall assist case, horizontal control, normal. Normal camera speed. I think it's the motion blur that's giving me some issues because I get motion sick with some of my games. Motion blur, motion blur. Let's lower the motion blur. Yeah, I think it's a bit better. No, naughty. <laughs> Crescent moon grass, helpful. The one thing that they did with this game is apparently they upped the weight of the moon grass. I forgot you could vault over things. Okay. Okay. Souls. Dear souls. Come at me, bro. They actually make the hollow screen. <coughs> Just go out around here. What was that? My character feels like he's running slow. Am I fat rolling? I think I'm mid rolling. What's my equip load? So, um, attack power, vitality, blah, 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 stamina, 88, item burden, item discovery, equip burden, nah, we're below, so this is our, f <coughs> this is fast rolling, alright. go back and explore. Oh. Well. Forlorn Outpost. For starters, I hate the Forlorn. Just in any Souls game, they're just a bunch of pricks. Alright. Read message. Strong attack. Don't need strong attack if you're a magician. Suck on that, buddy. Alright, what do we got? Locked. Parry. Oh, my parry time is going to be horrible. I'm not even going to attempt to mess around with that. I want to conserve health. And that's why you pick royalty as your first class. So it's only a blue-eyed soldier. The red-eyed ones are a bit of a pain. Locked. Okay, so you can dual wield a weapon. Got him. Let's 
something's here, I don't know. Parkman grass. Helpful. <laughs> they felt the need to put that there because I am a magic user. here. So you got a half moon grass and crescent. Crescent does a tiny bit, half does a bit more. All right. Where am I going again? Am I vaulting? I'm not. I just ran up here, shot this dude. Must be going here. You really need to play this game with headphones. Oh, Bad man. Bad archer. I don't want to enter the fog. I want to examine corpse. Crescent Moongrass, thank you. Is there anything there of note? I don't think there was. Alright. So we're going to sit here for a bit. You want to know why? So we can recover our MP. Okay. See, that was a dumb idea. Don't go switching to your weapon straight away. So we got to wait for... What are these... Indicators? Okay, we're at 23% equip burden. We're that percent item burden. Roll this, solo vitality, blah, 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 blah. They introduced spell power and miracle power. Interesting. That's a new stat. I don't remember seeing that before. So I've got an increased item discovery. And I've got MP regen. Currently active. <laughs> I didn't see you there. Half moon grass. Is this it? Are we at the big boss? I think we might be. You're joking me. I rolled straight into the idiot. I'm an idiot. Soul of the Lost withdrawn from its vessel. Soul of the Lost. Let strength be granted so the world might be mended. Soul of the Lost withdrawn from its vessel. Let strength be granted so the world might be mended. So the world, so the world might be mended. This is the Nexus. It holds together the northern land of Boletaria. the Nexus, but the five archstones will guide thee to the outer lands. Yep. So, I done goofed. I dodged to the right instead of to the left. I forgot about that. See, so yeah, I dodged to Nexial Binding, yep. So I ended up dodging to the right instead of going that way. 
We could have killed that boss, and if you kill that boss, when you get to the end, you get a bunch of soul stones that help level you up, which is very useful. But we didn't. Well, you slipped through the fissure too, did you? You came for demon souls? Or to save this land and be remembered as a hero? <laughs> Hunting for demons? Try one of the arch stones. Now go. That is why you came, is it not? Is it not? To this accursed Politaria. Accursed Politaria. Okay, so. Settings, audio. Is there subtitles? Oh. Too bright. I want subtitles, please. Subtitles on. So they've added cutscenes as you, like, little in-game scenes as you talk to people. Hmm. You new here. Are you here for my services? The name's Baldwin. I'm just an ordinary blacksmith. It's simple. Just bring me all the souls you can. In trade, I'll give you weapons. Or forge the ones you already have. With your souls, I can eke out a living. And with my weapons, you can go on living. Not a bad deal, eh? Okay. So, repairing equipment. As you block attacks and hit things with swords, your equipment becomes damaged and worn over time. You have to fix that. You have to, um... Uh... You know, repair your equipment. Fresh spice. Dagger shields of battle axe, shield, arrow, bolts, cracked... Cracked ice stone. No interest, eh? I can tell you're not going to last long. Okay, this guy, he's the best. He's a good boy. I'm Stockpile Thomas. When the scuds came, I didn't know what hit me. I didn't know what hit me. When I came to, I found myself here in this nexus. My wife and Rip. daughter fell victim. victim to the demons. But I would be worthless in battle. I would be happy to lighten your load <laughs> and look after any excess. Okay. All God of Souls. That is just a stone indicator. A ripe yard we don't actually need. We're going to replace the ripe yard. I wish I could do more. A candle maiden, she says very little, poor, poor girl. If only something could be done to help her. If only something could be done to help her. Best of luck to you. So yeah, that's why I'm wearing the Irish flag here. Because a lot of them talk like this. Because they've been trapped in the Nexus. Time for talking. Now, Stockpile Thomas is meant to help lighten your inventory and equip load. He's meant to give you a ring to assist you when things get a bit heavy. Now, over here... Is where you'll find Sage Freak or Freak's Apprentice. Thank you. Which you can't see at the moment because they haven't appeared yet. I forgot about that. Alright. Um, we should probably be able to unlock that after we go to the first Archstone. But where is the Maiden in Black? She's the one we need to see. Where is the Maiden? Maiden, where'd you go? So her position in this nexus, she disappears and reappears everywhere. Like she just pops up one where one area, pops up another area. Very frustrating when you're trying to hunt the hunt the girl down. Item over there. There is an item over there. I cannot remember how to get it. I think. I think there was an item. 
So where'd the maiden go? She was legitimately here, and I've lost her now. That's right. Let's just jump straight into things. Head to the gates of Boletaria. Now in Demon Souls, when you die and you are no longer human, your health gets halved. It's a feature of the game. Feature of all Souls games. goes a wyvern. Gets a Boletaria, neutral world tendency. Alright, so for starters, to clear up misconception, that is a wyvern, not a dragon. Dragons have four legs and wings, wyvern have two legs and wings. Know your mythical creatures, people. Secondly, the concept of world tendency and character tendency, you will find Certain areas of your game unlocked. Is that a bloodstain? Oh, I thought there was like a bloodstain for me to collect. So this will take you back to the Nexus. So depending on your world tendency, certain areas will unlock. Oh, multi boy. <laughs> So yes, I'm using my sword instead of magic. So this will open if your world tendency is either black or white. Boy. Crescent Moongrass. Now, I don't quite know how to talk to the maiden in black, because she wasn't there. I feel like I need to do that first. So let's just run back, because I want to get a bunch of items from Stockpiler Thomas. So let's just head back to the Nexus, and... Cool. Everything's pitch black. Not helpful. Um, Stockpiler Thomas, can you please tell me where the Maiden's gone? I would be happy to lighten your load, and look up. Organized storage. Best of luck to you. Maybe that's not a thing. Maybe the ring isn't a thing in this in this game anymore. Oh my! How has this happened? Has God abandoned us for King oh, Umbasa? <laughs> Umbasa. So these guys are the faith people. So they do faith-related spells and stuff. You have to beat the first archstone before the, any of the other ones become active, but I need to find the Maiden in Black to chat to her. Unless I have to chat to her after the first archstone, I don't know. I can't remember. I'm just going to um, jump right up here. You here, lady? You are not. So I think I have to do the first the first arch then before I can chat to the maiden in black again. Apologies for the backtracking people, it's just the way things are. Alright. We're gonna do things properly now. Oh, the start is wrong item. boy. Alright. The great thing about Soul Arrow, it cares about, it cares about gaps. This isn't Soul Arrow, uh, by the way, I think this is just, um, is it Soul Arrow? I don't know. It's your basic level 1 spell. That's the limitation of magic. People can dodge it easily. You telegraph it. Stay down. 
You gonna come out of here or? Ooh, flaming sword, huh? Throw down, buddy. Okay. Is this door open? It is not. That opens later. We have to progress through this stage and open it later. Firebomb. Useful. Very useful, because the boss is weak to fire attacks. a bit of damage there. That was dumb. But that's okay. Still getting used to this. Now, don't fall in here. Just don't. This is a trap for new players. It got me too. It does nothing. I know you can see stairs down there, but it's just a hole that leads you to nothing. It is there to troll people. It is not in any other part of the game. It just exists here. Just to screw with you. Crescent Moongrass. Alright. I didn't hear you. Better give it that. The animations are clean in this game. Okay. Basic hollows. Alright, over here, what do we got? Firebomb, five. Useful. Very useful. Um, there's something here. There's you guys. So enemies, upon getting hit, can stagger. Just that little bit. Gives you a chance to run up with a second attack. Not all of them do this. Some of them have high poison and just will shrug it off like nothing happened. Let's get everything down here. Mailbreaker. Now, we're not a strength character. So we don't have the right equipment to carry this. Malbreak is an item that can pierce through armor. Now these white little things here, they're like phantoms. Like they're just showing people that are also playing the game alongside you and are at this area. I am up for summoning for this game. Like I've got no qualms against it. it I actually have never played a soul game. Oh, shit, we co-op. Sorry, as I was saying, I've never played a cooperative Souls game. I've sort of only soloed these games with everything I've done. Which is all cool, but like, not as fun. You're missing out on a good piece of... Naughty, naughty, naughty. What is over here? It's because you can walk down here. Is there something of use here? There is not. I might be thinking of a different area. That's okay. To be expected for some shenanigans. Think I didn't notice you, buddy? So the annoying thing is, when you raise your shield, it doesn't automatically turn your camera this way, like it did in the old games. You have to sort of manually turn yourself, so you just got to be conscious of that when you're trying to play this. I don't think it always did that, but I know in some of the games there was a setting that allowed you to do that. So we have some sunlight. Sunlight bad. People are here. <laughs> So I'm out of MP at the moment. So I need to switch to a Ripier. 
Okay, so... I need to let my MP heal up a bit. Get down there. Need to let that boulder run its course. Uh, very naughty, aren't they? Very mean people. That was completely unnecessary, sir. But it gives me a bastard sword. Hi, boulder. Um, we need to get out of this area and go back up. My MP is still taking a while to recharge, but that is okay, because I don't have a Crescent weapon. If you have a weapon that's infused with Crescent magic, it naturally increases your MP over time, like re regenerates your MP. Look for trap. Thank you, game. We did that already. So we're going to have to just do this as melee. I'm not too good at melee in this game. Let's just take this. But we'll learn. We'll get used to things. Okay. Nope. So there's a blue-eyed knight over there. There's an archer over here. Find him and go for the backstab. Oh, you prick. Who did that? Oh, there's an archer. What was I hitting? I feel like I was hitting something other than him. My character is not optimized for close combat. No, hold on. Half my grass. Now what we have coming over here is an area that we shouldn't really be indulging with. So this bloke here is guarding an entrance to another bloke. He is strong. Not even trying to sugarcoat it. This guy, he will fuck your shit up. What most people used to do would lead him was to lead him out and knock him down this flight of stairs. Like literally lead him all the way out here and try and shoot him down. Now I'm contemplating whether we attempt to attack this guy. Because he's got a stupidly long reach. And the weapon up the back up there, I can't remember what it is. I can't remember if it was something useful or not. Like, this guy will just... He'll cream you. See? He's coming right at ya. And he'll dodge everything you throw at him. be de-aggroing as you leave the area. This is outside his area. He should be walking back. Nope, he is not. He's still following me. Did they fix it? He's still following me. I 
fell down. I didn't mean to fall down. Fuck, where's he gone? I didn't mean to fall down. Shit. This guy might be on his way to fuck my shit up. Nope. He is relentless. He'll follow you fucking everywhere. I've just aggroed this guy and he just will not quit. Is he glitched? Did we glitch him? Oh, he's over here. <laughs> okay. Alright, dude, what are you doing? So you're over there. So if you're over there, can I shoot you from another area? Or do I have to genuinely run past you? Okay, he's leaving. He's leaving. While he leaves, let's just try and stab him in the back. Nope. We have pissed him off now. Nope. Oh, he's up here. Nope. Holy shit, props to you Demon Souls, you fucking made this guy impossible. How far can we go, seriously? He is here to, <laughs> to fuck my shit up. He is not gonna, he is not gonna quit. Got stabbed right through the fucking crates. <sighs> now, well. now every single enemy has respawned. So we've learned a lesson. We're still going to aggro that guy because we lost our souls. We don't care. This guy has now pissed me off. I need to... I need to make him die. So we are going to go kill this dude. Does he drop anything worthwhile? No idea. as well. So we done goofed. That's okay, we can farm firebombs off these guys. Dead and up here. Bolt. Should be all the souls that we got from killing all those people. Crescent Moongrass. Um 
Yeah, it's been that long since I've played a Souls game. I'm very rusty at it. It would help if I had a Crescent weapon. Dead, dead. Should be more shenanigans. I can hear footsteps. Pew pew. Yeah, there's a guy that should be throwing charges above me. See, rude. I think we didn't. <laughs> <laughs> well, he took care of himself. Okay, so let's take this Mel Breaker. You don't have the stats to use this weapon. I have the stats for a Mel Breaker, but the Rapier will do more. So we're using the Rapier. Let's two hand this bit, this bad boy. Cool. Let's remember this move set because we're going to need it. Crescent moon grass, awesome. Nothing to throw at us, buddy. Very useful down narrow staircase is the rapier. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna unto hand this. One hand it, unto hand. Stab this bloke. Now we need to be going the other way, but remember how I told you that I'm committed to beating that knight? I wasn't joking, I am. Okay. okay. Alright. We know what lies in front of us here. How? The thing is, you can't de-aggro him. You throw something at him and he will chase you to oblivion. In the other game, he didn't do that. But he is weak to magic. You saw what we did to him. What have we got? Yeah, I need to recharge. I need to recharge MP. I don't want to sit here waiting for my MP to recharge. I need to come up with a cheap way to take care of this guy. We don't have any poison on this stage. So let us... Quick firebombs, which I don't think we'll do. We'll keep it for the phalanx. We'll take care of all the other enemies and come back to them later. <laughs> Screams. <laughs> woo, woo. Read message. Time for vaulting. So if I vault down here, we get access to an item. Hmm. Maybe I would vault here. What's here though? <laughs> 
so they're trying to take care of this guy. We'll go there later. We'll deal with that clan later. Let's go to this side so we can unlock the fast way to get to this area. I think. Firebomb. Nice. Um, let's get our spells ready. Oh my. Well, that guy's an idiot. Thought we blew that up. this all the way down and this gives us a staircase back to this area here. But first, let's make sure no one's here. Cool. There's an item that has just dropped down there, which would be useful to us. Thank you. No, I've got spooked by a phantom again. Oh shit. One of them did something right down there. Okay, I don't want to read message, I want to pull lever. Less HP reduction in soul form. So Kling Ring is another noob ring. This raises item discovery. This just gives you more HP in general. So there is nothing here I need to necessarily farm from anyone. So the Provincial Ring, we're going to swap that out for a Kling Ring. See our health? It's just increased. That's what we want. There we go. Now that we're in this situation, yeah. we need to go back up and vault over that edge to get some stuff. Because we've done all that we need to do on this side of the tower. The last area is the center room, which you need to do to open the main gates. That other room, you get to it later. There's no need to go to it now. You can just beat that enemy to test yourself if you're feeling ever so devilish. Uh, time for vaulting. We now have a crossbow. What have we got in here? Okay, we're back here now. So this area should be familiar to you now. If I was better at parrying, I should be able to defeat that red-eyed knight very easily, but I'm not. I was never good at parrying in any soul game. So let's just go ahead and open the phalanx doors. Um, which I think you're doing here. There we go. And 50-50 whether we save this guy about to be done in by these people. <laughs> Burn. Burn. 
Bowling is the best option. Indeed it is. Hello, you. Good day to you. Care to look over my wear? Mostly stolen, but... Yes, I'd like to look at your wear. We got bolts, club, spear, crossbow, wooden shield, sword shield, dribbling. Stops bleeding, fire bombs, moon grass, long sword, club. So this gives you new armor set that you can mess around with. But the key thing this guy has that would be of use to you is a firebomb. This is especially useful against the phalanx. How many firebombs do I currently have? You'd want to stay under 40 item burden. I can only buy two. Go ahead. I'm not going in. You know what? I'll come back to you. Thank you, dude. So over here, lots of exploding drums. Exploding drums are bad. Down here is one way to get to the areas, but over here is another. Fudge, I forgot about this whole place. Souls, the gang squad is here to welcome your arrival. Yar. So we've got a archer up there. We've got random crap over here. Bom, 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 bom. <laughs> this whole area that I barely recognize. be some blue-eyed knights, so maybe I'll save this for some blue-eyed knights. Unknown warrior soul is useful. There should be a blue-eyed knight up here. <laughs> Throw him off the edge. <laughs> Alright. Read message. This is the way. Do you know the way? Eh, who knows. Um, nothing's here. Something gives me post-trauma about this place. I didn't mean to do that. So this is your early game grinding spot. Mail breaker. Crescent Moongrass. Soldier's Lotus. Crescent Moongrass again. Keep your shield up, going around areas. What the fuck was that? Bloodstain. Oh, this area. Fuck off. Oh god, I've forgotten everything about this game. There's stuff here. That side leads to dragons. That side leads to Lestra. Just leads to one dragon. You have to kill the dragon at some point in these games. These are useful items. 
You got blue dragon, you got red dragon. They're both evil. This whole area here is just for the purpose of attempting to kill these motherfucking dragons. There's nothing else here. There's a bunch of drops. You can suicide your way through them. But, do it later. There's ways to get this done. You just have to be patient. Get some health on hand. And let the dragon burn everything. That's what I want to hear. So the dragon landed there. I don't know how much of the bridge gets set on fire when he flies past. There he is. See this guy just fucking run. Just pull the lever. Pull the lever. Oh my god. It's scary. First boss. Someone's cranky. So there's loot on the bridge. We don't need to worry about that loot on the bridge. Over here, what do we got? Change to our catalyst. Main. Cricking shield. Now that didn't auto. You see how he stabbed me in the back? You'd expect that to auto guard if you're held in the guard position, but sometimes it doesn't for some reason. But anyways. We've got Pine Resin, very useful. That's something that you buff over your weapon so you can deal additional damage. Very good for later bosses. What the fuck was that? Come here, I'll show you what Bulletari is all about. Corpse. Half in grass, yeah. Sound good. Alright, we've got some moon grass. What have we got down here? Is there anything concerning? Oh, hollows. <laughs> Shield. Oh. Too fat to get past. Int 
potential hardstone shard. We've already got a first piece of upgrade material. What have we got down here? Stuff. Skata. Dead body. Rude. at it all day. Half moon grass. Lever. So we have now opened levers to both sides of this. Both sides of the castle. But we haven't done everything though. There's the red-eyed knight, yeah. We're gonna ignore him though. We need to actually go down to where that guy was getting ganked by the clan and activate his quest line. He gives you some useful sets of armor later on in the game, but you probably won't use it. And there's no trophies in this game for obtaining all weapons or all rings or anything anymore. I think. So it's made it considerably easy, trophy-wise. This is a very fair game for trophy hunting. It's very achievable. Here. Oh shit, the dragon, I forgot about that. Crap, I'm gonna start with fucking dragon again. Alright, so we got through that with no dragon. Some balls right here. Run, 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 run. I know this is the long way to backtrack, but this is the only way I remember. Because you won't ever need to come back to Boletaria 1 1. Except for World Tendency events. Alright, so we're back here. We do not need. Oops. We do not need this upper area. sick now. We're gonna go this way. See, these guys look angry. Can I go through here? I can. He broke me shield. You have to be more precise with your parries in this game. By the looks of things at least. Soul. Nothing here. Just blue boy with a sword. Terrible. Lightning grass. I'll take it. Alright. 
was a leaf. That scared the shit out of me. Sweating, it's hot. Scimitar. I can't get through here. Killed everything here. Yes, hello. You're gonna come down now. I've cleared everything. No, oh, you use the sack of crap. I gotta go get you the long way now. I'm getting motion sick. I don't do well with games. trying to parry, it's just not working. My timing's probably way off anyways. Okay, so there was no reason to go here whatsoever. Can I get up? I cannot get up from here. Now this level is short, I'm just making it longer than it should be. Now that we're through here... find where he was getting cornered and go save him. Don't remember how to get to where he was though. He's merchant boy. Oh, it's hot. Okay, we're here. So 
there, there, there. Red Eye Knight is there. We just came out of the center. Do we dare attack the Red Eyed Knight? I reckon we do dare. I reckon we attempt to beat the ever loving shit out of this guy for what he has done to us. Because we've unlocked everything. We can go straight for the boss at this point. Oh. Hot. Alright. Let's get our souls ready. Gave us a full moon grass. But there we go, we beat the red eyed knight. And the thing that we got from that was a soul. A unknown, appears to be locked, an unknown hero soul. So it was absolutely pointless coming to beat this guy. There was absolutely zero reason for us to have done that. Because we're not ready for that area yet. It did give us a good stack of souls though. So I guess it was for bragging rights. We are however going to try and rescue that dude. Whatever the frick his name is. just have no idea where he is though. I think you get to him from this side. I could be wrong. I saved him by clearing out the enemies, but I have to actually go onto his platform in order for him to register that I've saved him. No, I don't think it's here. I do not think it's here, but let's just get down here anyways. Firebomb. Alright. Before I proceed, I just need to figure out how to get to that guy. So, Bo I forgot how to get to him. Boletaria 1-1. One, one. Rescue. Australia, that's it. Rescue Australia. Sweating. Sorry, guys. I don't exactly know how to get to him. Drop mausoleum key. That's what we want. He's an assassination target, I know that. Jumping down from the ledge above, you can clear the area below him and he will jump down and join you. Well, I did... I did clear the area, so he should be thanking me. And I can go get this item now. That's why I came here. Jade hair ornament. I need the jade hair ornament. That's how I get the items from. What's his face? It's alright. Happy accidents, people. Happy...
We should have no enemies here because we've killed them all. We're almost done with this level. I promise you. Just gotta rescue Ostrava. Then we're good. Then I'll come back and do the dragons later. Okay. So we need to jump down. hop over this. How do I get down to him? Climb up. Get down there. By some means that I don't know. Because I've cleared the enemies, he should be able to follow us now. Is there jumping in Demon Souls? I forgot whether there was. <sighs> it's hot. <laughs> I've cleared them. He's not coming back out. Strava of Boletaria will not come down. I've glitched him. Can I wave to him? Hit him with an arrow soon. <laughs> this is annoying. I'll get him later. I'll get him in my own time. Let's just beat this boss because I'm struggling to keep going. I'm very lightheaded at the moment because it's very hot. We're off to go fight the phalanx. Equip our fire bombs. Equip our magic. Huh. 
take the shortcuts down. So the moment you've all been waiting for people, we're going to go kill the phalanx. Phalanx, phalanx. I'm pronouncing it like a Pokemon at the moment. Ooh. Raggedy robes. Alright. You ready, people? Let's go. Let's go back to the Nexus. Okay, for starters, before I go talk to the Monumental... That ornament... That belongs to my daughter. I think she didn't make it after all. My dearest little baby. May she rest in peace. Oh, Thomas. May I ask a favour? Would you mind giving me that hair ornament? I'd like to have it in memory of my daughter. You're a saint. Thank you. I mustn't forget. <sighs> it's not much, but please accept this as thanks. I found it discarded on the main road. It might look ordinary, but it seems to possess a strange power. Anyway. So Ring of Herculean Strength allows you to carry items beyond your equip load. Very useful. Now let's go chat to this monumental. Nope, I have gone the wrong way again.
Okay, we're up here. We need to go higher. There we go. We have long awaited you, slayer of demons. I am one of the monumentals. There is a tale I wish to tell you. Once we... In the distant past, under benevolent rule, the world was united owing to the soul art. Until a lust for power caused the awakening of the old one. Across the land seeped a colorless, deep fog, and the world faced extinction at the hands of the demons. Thanks be, we were able to lull the old one back to its slumber. Yet only after the loss of innumerable souls and most of the world, lost, erased by the fog. In order to mend the fabric of what land still remained, we entrusted six leaders with six precious archstones, one to the king of a small yet industrious land. Yea, Lord. One to the king of the burrowers underground. One to the wise queen of the great ivory tower. One to the chieftain of lost and ill-fortuned souls. One to the shaman of the tempest-worshipping shadowman. And the last to the great giants of the northern lands. The archstones were placed in the fringelands that survived. We contained the old one here below the nexus and prohibited the soul arts. Finally, we became monumentals, half living sentinels of the fabric of reality. Alas, the other monumentals have perished, and only I remain. There's some love for you. The four sealed archstones have been unlocked. Now, so we can now travel to other worlds. Have you the strength to bear this burden? Yes, now, the old one. motion sick thank you all for joining I'll catch you next time I'm gonna go pass out for a bit I'll catch you all later hope you enjoyed the stream take care for now